getting from Vancouver Island to the mainland is pretty simple. You just take one of the different ferries that are available from different locations. This one starts off in Schwartz Bay, which is on the north side of the Saanich Peninsula, and travels to the mainland, going in between the amazing Gulf Islands on its way, which are extremely scenic as you can see here, especially in the spring and the summer. And these ferries carry a lot of cars and passengers. Normally they're quite busy, but uh, at this time, because of the COVID restrictions, it's essential travel only. And it was a little eerie because there was hardly anyone there. Finally, after coming through the Gulf Islands, you emerge. And here we are looking at the Tsawasan Ferry Terminal on the mainland side. The next day I traveled across Vancouver using SkyTrain right to New Westminster where the car was held at the terminal. Hello, it's an auspicious day today here. Uh, I just arrived in the uh, Queensborough neighborhood of New Westminster, which is kind of in the middle of a couple of branches of the uh, Fraser River. Um, and I walked over from the SkyTrain, which was quite a lot of fun just to kind of snoop around and see the area. And I'm, in, I'm at Canuck Towing, which is the terminal for US Canada Auto Transport, the company that uh, shipped the S2000 uh, from Florida. So let's take a walk in and have a look at the car. I already had a quick look at it but and got permission to film but let's go and have a look. Dun, 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 there we go and there it is. Not, as, not too dirty. I thought it might be more covered in grime but it's actually not that bad. It was done open transport which is a lot cheaper. Kind of cut down some of the hard costs of doing this. I see it got shit on here by a bird. I'll have to blurb that out. It looks absolutely great. Even with a little bit, a little patina of dirt on it, this is going to be real exciting. All right. Well, I think it's time to slap some temporary, uh, permits on it uh, get in and find out if it runs and curse at the guy if it doesn't but otherwise and I'll check the oil too that's another thing because you never know always check the oil all right see you in two all right I checked the oil it's all fine put the top down well started it up of course and it's now running purring quietly and smoothly which is uh, very nice inspected it carefully inspected the outside um, it's really clean. The drivers uh, have to mark all the little blemishes on the car and every single little tiny blemish was marked on the sheet and we had a look at it and um, even a minute little scratch was noted so I'll, I'll give you an example. On the driver's side mirror that was noted but it's like the tiniest little blemish in the, in the uh, paint so I like the thoroughness of uh, US Canada uh, to really take responsibility for the condition of the cars. There was another little thing uh, was a little bit noted on the rim at the rear here. I think it was at the rear. Yeah. <clears throat> so there's a little something there and that is that is absolutely tiny. So 
I'm, uh, I'm really pleased there's another little bit there and that actually can be touched up I'm surprised it hasn't been touched up that's very easy to touch up but anyway hello yeah so it looks real good yep put my uh, permits on here I took I'm taking a little chance with the permit at the rear um, because I wanted to drive with the top down partly and so I I put it here because there's no rear window when you have the top down so I thought well you know if I put it on the rear window then I can't put the top down right anyway little dilemma all right now so now it's uh, now it's time for the return trip back to Victoria via BC ferries we'll see what we get we should be able to make any of the sailings today quite easily from here so I think I'll just head out that way and then see how it feels see what time I want to head back to the island. All right, get in the car now. Here we are, we're now headed in the opposite direction. We're going back through the Gulf Islands and back to Swartz Bay Ferry Terminal so I can get back down the peninsula and go home, take the car home. And there's a, quite a lot of stuff to do once I get the car home because I need to have it inspected for uh, BC. Since it's an American car, it didn't have daytime running lights on it. Um, so I'll have to do a daytime running light conversion to it. So I'll show you that on the channel as well. But uh, mainly I just want to get it home, give it a nice uh, wash today, just to get it clean so I can see how it looks and um, get working on that, on that next step, which is getting it ready for certification in Canada here. But I'm really looking forward to getting the car home today. That's for sure. It's been fun so far and it drives great really drives great, so I'm really happy so far. 